Hi Cancer, Suns, Moons and Rising Signs. Okay, um, so for you guys, what I got was kind of like you were pulling the sword out of the stone. And it's kind of like, I don't know, it's I, the vibe that I got from that whole scene was that something fits you, you know, and it fits you like a glove. This is meant for you and it's your mission and it's your path. You know, nobody else can do this. And it's kind of like I saw you kind of having to... Um, as soon as you took it out, it's almost like you were drawn, like magnetised towards something, you know, and it was kind of just like everything just made sense and everything just kind of clicked into place. Now, I do feel like the next two weeks is heavily focusing on this decision that you have to make, you know, and I feel like it's an old decision. I don't feel like this is necessarily like a new one um, because obviously we are coming up to like the end of the year and um 2016 is a number nine cycle year okay it's it's about endings and um, 2017 will be the year of the rooster you know it's um brand new beginnings awakenings you know everything in full motion so i feel like there are some things that you still have to decide on before you can fully transition into that new vibration um i also feel like okay so the next two weeks I feel like it's going to be to do with, um, you know, old matters of heart. You know, something that's been there for a really long time. It can be, like, connecting with old family members, connecting with... Um, there's some sort of history vibe that I'm getting here. You know, something from the past, maybe. Maybe an old relationship. Maybe just, like, something that you didn't get to do and now is a time where you get to go do it. Yeah? Does that make sense? Hopefully that makes sense. Um... It's kind of like I see, it's almost like, it's kind of like, I don't want to say, because I always say it, but it kind of feels like this was meant to happen. You were meant to go to this place, you were meant to spend time with these people because of X, Y, Z. Um, and I feel like it'll be a really, really good time. I feel like it'll be really um, happy and joyous. Um, but I also feel like you're going to have to stand your ground on a few things, okay? Um, and I do feel like there will be a reconnection or an old sort of conversation, communication coming back in. And it's kind of like I see you with the sword, um, whatever it is, the sword of Excalibur, I think it is. Um, and you're kind of at this mountain top. And the only way down is for you to literally dive off of it. Um, unless you go back and you face whatever it is that you need to kind of deal with. Um, and I feel like that's what it's about. I feel like it is about facing some things. I feel like you have a decision to make and it may not be an easy one and it may not even make like a logical, rational sense to you. Um, but I feel like there's some sort of ending, some sort of death, some sort of surprising information, something that hits you out of the blue that questions a lot of things for you. You know, it puts things into perspective for you to kind of be put on this path of whatever it is that you're meant to be doing um i do see you going on a journey i do see you kind of moving through some stuff as well um and as well maybe something that you wanted before may not be what you want right now it may not actually you know it's kind of like you wanted this and now you've got it and now that you've got it you're kind of like okay well how do i get now to there you know um, I do feel like there is something that you've yet to discover. There's like a piece of information that you need that's going to unlock and make so much more sense. Now, something that I will say is that a friend that you may have, um, some sort of invitation that you may receive. Now, I feel like this is a working thing. I feel like there's a work link here. Um, this person you, you shouldn't trust. Um, there's someone that isn't being forthright with you and I don't know I get the imagery of stealing taking something from you um that's rightfully maybe yours um what's important though is that you don't stay stuck don't stay stuck in a situation um I feel like there's some sort of business connection some business sort of com like contract or something um and you should just be very like with it you know especially when money is concerned be with it um, I'm seeing gossip as well. Maybe someone takes a fancy to you and you hear something. Um, but I, I feel like you are going on a journey. I feel like you are moving, maybe not moving, like permanently moving. But I see movement. I see like you actively going to do something. Um, and I'm seeing news. 
Now it could be news of an ending, news of a contract terminated, it could be news of a death, it could be news of something to do with the past because they're showing me a symbol that I associate with like history and stuff. So I feel like it's old news but there is something that you haven't seen within this news that is the piece of information that you need to make everything make sense. Um, I feel like that's what they're trying to say. But I do see endings and I do see you breaking free of a past section of your life as well. So that's, I, I feel like that's all I've got for you guys. Um, hopefully this relates to you. If it does, please do give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below and um, keep me posted. If you would like a personal one-on-one -on -one reading with me, um, you can do so at my website, www.askalittlewitch.com. But I will be closing my store the second week in of December, just as a heads up. Um, and it will reopen at the very, very, very end of December, beginning of January 2017. So thank you so much and I will speak to you soon. Bye.